it's Holly. Welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm going to be reacting to episode two and three from season one of Avatar The Last Airbender. I absolutely loved the first episode. I feel like I've fallen in love with the characters already. It was just such a great episode from start to finish. You know, it really set the tone. I feel like I got to know the characters a little bit more. So what happened? Where we left off last was like a little bit of a cliffhanger because Katara and Aang went to the shipwreck and sadly it was booby trapped. So it sent a signal to Zuko and like the firebender people on that ship. So um, now Zuko knows where the avatar is and... I don't know what to expect. I'm guessing he's just gonna like, I'm like, I'm expecting him to, I don't know, march up to the tribe and be like, hey, hand him over, but I might be wrong. Just so you know, over on Patreon, I am doing, I'm not doing timer reactions, but I am gonna be doing kind of like full opacity, no blurring and, um, all of that good stuff. I have had, sadly on YouTube, I have had a lot of copyright issues with this show. Um, and would you believe it if I told you that the first episode I had to re-edit five times before it passed. So I am very sorry in advance for any blurring or cropping that I have to do, but I will keep the audio the same if I can. And if you did want to get ahead over on my Patreon, I am offering like a better viewing experience if you did want to go over there. Let's get into it. Also, because I'm not doing timer reactions, I'm really excited to be able to like pause if I need to. Wait, do they? Okay, I feel like they're sus. Are they suspicious? I knew it. You signal the fire navy with <gasps> You're leading them straight to us. Oh, damn it. They saw the flare as well? Yeah, we were on the ship and there was this booby trap and well, we we boobied right into it. Katara. <laughs> we boobied right into it. Sokka is right. I think it best if the airbender leaves. <gasps> Fine. Then I banish too. Oh my god! No way. We're going to find a waterbender. I bet he'll go with them. To the North Pole. I bet. I bet Sokka will go with them. Wow. I it's so sad. Not looking forward to that. <sighs> oh. Let's see your bison fly now, air boy. Come on, Appa. You can do it. Come on, you big baby. Yeah, I thought so. Oh. oh. Hey, don't go. I'll miss you. Oh. Oh my god. Why are my eyes watering? I liked her too. <gasps> Surely he's gonna go back and like stop them from getting involved. Surely. Appa, wait here. <laughs> Whoa. Wait, but how would they go against the Fire Nation? Oh my god. He could, like they could melt all of their homes like Oh no. Oh man. <gasps> oh shit. Is this the first time we've like actually seen the ship scale? Whoa. Whoa. Holy crap. Oh my god, the two to the side are so menacing. What the hell? <gasps> oh! oh my god. Girl. I know you're hiding him. Ah, oh, I 
Over the head! Over the head! Over the head! <gasps> I feel bad for laughing, but like, what did he- Oh, a boomerang? Oh! That looked like a boomerang. That had to have been a boomerang. <laughs> the comical boings in this are so satisfying. <gasps> yeah! <laughs> Do you know what? Hold on. I'm going to say it right now. Zuko... Okay, Zuko to me already feels like the anti-villain. Like, he's made out to be a villain, but I don't actually know... Like, he just, he doesn't feel inherently evil. He feels like he's just been born into the firebender sort of group of people. And he's just naive. Like, he's just a kid as well. I don't know what it is. Maybe it's because, like, I don't know. I I don't know. I'm really, really not sure. I'll be interested to see, like, kind of how his character develops, I think. Looking for me? You're the airbender? You're the avatar? Yeah, boy. No way. Oh, wait, yeah, because they don't... Yeah, because they don't know that, I guess. Okay. No, Aang, don't do this! Don't worry, Katara. It'll be okay. Oh. Aang reminds me a lot of Tanjiro, like doing all these like selfless things. Nation, I'm going home. <laughs> I'm going home. Wow. Oh, Katara. Oh, oh, she really like she really wanted to do the things with him. Aang saved our tribe. Now we have to save him. Katara, I... Why can't you realize that he's on our side? If we don't help him, no one will. I know you don't like Aang, but we owe him... Katara, are you going to talk all day or are you coming with me? <gasps> Sucker! Oh my Dead. god. We're going to save your boyfriend. He's not my... Whatever. What do you two think you're doing? <gasps> You'll need these. Oh my god, Grand Grand! It's been so long since I've had hope, but you brought it back to life, my little waterbender. Oh no, my eyes are watering. Be nice to your sister. Yeah, okay, Gran. Aang is the Avatar. He's the world's only chance. You both found him for a reason. Now your destinies are in- I've got goosebumps. There's no way we're going to catch a warship with a canoe. <gasps> Abba! Oh my god, so like this is where... You just love taking me out of my comfort zone. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that, that felt so emotional. Because I thought there was going to be so many walls put up and then there just wasn't. <gasps> oh shit! Oh my god! Let's go! <laughs> the Aang is not to be messed with. He's so powerful. Oh, look! Go. Fly. Soar. Please, Appa. It's Appa Yip Yip! Up. Ascend. <laughs> Elevate. Sokka doesn't believe you can fly. But I do, Appa. Come on, don't you want to say- You have to say the words! What was it that kid said? <gasps> Yeehaw! Hop, no! Hop. Wahoo! Uh, yip yip! Yeah! Let's go! You did it, Sokka! Oh! He's flying! He's flying! Katara, he's- <laughs> I love Sokka so much. Like, when he lets his guard down, he is so... F My staff! 
Looks like I underestimated you. Oh no. Oh. Oh. Dunno, that grunt. <laughs> Maybe he is evil. I feel like Aang's gonna be like, how did you get him to fly? Aang, no! Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Aang. Wait, Aang. can he breathe underwater? How the hell did he do that? Some water bending. Oh, so he's got this like power that he can only tap into when he's like in like grave danger or something. Got it. Oh, I I knew I knew that was gonna happen. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. Oh, Appa! Come on, Gally, do your bit. Oh! <laughs> Go on, girl! Uh, I mean, that's something. That's something! Oi, oi, oi. <gasps> wow. Oh my god. The Fire Nation's greatest threat is just a little kid. Yeah. That kid, uncle, just did this. I won't underestimate him again. Yeah. What happens when he, like, becomes an adult and he's even more powerful? How wow. How did you do that? With the water? It was the most amazing thing I've ever seen. I don't know. I just sort of did it. Oh. Why didn't you tell us you were the Avatar? Because I never wanted to be. Oh, no. I wonder why. You need to first master water, then earth, then fire, right? That's what the monks told me. Well, if we go to the North Pole, you can master waterbending. And so can she. We'll it together. Yeah! Get to knock some firebender heads on the way. I'd like that. <laughs> I'd really like that. Then we're in this together. All right, but before I learn waterbending, we have some serious business to attend to. What? Here, here, and here. What's there? Here, we'll ride the hopping llamas. Then way over here, we'll surf on the backs of giant koi fish. Then back over here, we'll ride the hog monkeys. They don't like people riding them, but that's what makes it fun. This boy, he is so pure and innocent. Wow, that was incredible. That was an incredible episode. Like, okay, so first of all, I absolutely loved that moment with, um, first of all, Sokka, who had the boat ready, and then Gran, who, who was like, okay, you're gonna need these. Like, considering I feel like so far, I mean, it had only been an episode and a half, I guess, but... It kind of feels like everyone in that tribe kind of just sticks between those, I guess, four walls of what they're used to. And so I think it's quite a big deal to have not only the blessing from like Katara's brother, but also the like the leader of their tribe. That just feels like so important. Zuko, I can't work out yet. Like he just feels, I think maybe because he's a teenager, he just feels very... Um, I can't see him as evil yet, I don't think. Like, I can see him as the bad guy, but, like, not necessarily 
evil? I don't know how to ex- like how to differentiate between the two, but to me, they're two very different things, you know? Like the framed bad guy versus someone who's like actually very nasty and malicious. He just seems too naive. And like his, his, his granddad is very um kind of blase about everything. And yeah. Most beautiful places in the world. Aang. I know you're excited, but it's been a hundred years since you've been home. That's why I'm so excited. It's just that... I'm so nervous that he is going to get there expecting to find all of these people and they're not going to be there. Like, because didn't they, didn't his people go extinct? So then he's like, oh my God, that's the worst. <laughs> this, I, I just know this is going to be the worst. Change in all that time. I know. But I need to see it for myself. What if it's like derelict? Wake up, Sokka! Air Temple, here we come! Uh, sleep now. Temple later. <gasps> He's hey, hungry! Stomach, be quiet, alright? I'm trying to find us some food. Aww. Crumbs! Hey, who ate all my blubbered seal jerky? Oh, that was food? I used it to start the campfire last night. Oh. Sorry. You what? Aww. They could have done the same to your people. Just because no one has seen an airbender doesn't mean the Fire Nation killed them all. They probably escaped. I know. I'm nervous. I'm nervous. I'm nervous. The only way to get to an airbender temple is on a flying bison. And I doubt the Fire Nation has any flying bison. Right, Appa? Okay. That could be a thing. Because how would they even get up there? Oh God, I'm not, I'm already not okay. I just, I just. There it is, <gasps> the Southern Air Temple. Whoa, that looks so cool. Dang, it's amazing. We're home, buddy, we're home. I'm just worried there's not gonna be any of his people there. Come on, Uncle, we're going. Commander Zhao, we interrogated the crew as you instructed. They confirmed Prince Zuko had the Avatar in custody. Oh, shit. Remind me, how exactly was your ship damaged? Oh, he's been found out. Uh-oh. How beautiful is that? And also so the where music. So do I get something to eat? You're lucky enough to be one of the first outsiders to ever visit an airbender temple, and all you can think about is food? I'm just a... Oh, that would be me, though. I'd be like, I need to eat. Seven, Sokka zero. Making him feel better is putting me in a world of hurt. Oh. So they did get there. Ow! What is it? Uh, just a new waterbending move I learned. Nice one, but enough practicing. We have a whole temple to see. Oh my god, it's gonna- I'm worried it's gonna be, like, completely burnt down. Oh, this is painful. I'm in pain watching this. Monkey Atso, the greatest airbender in the world. Wow. He taught me everything I know. But the true secret is in the gooey center. Oh! Making technique. Isn't the only thing on your mind, is it, Anne? Oh my god, what a sweet man! One, two, three. <laughs> oh, what is that? <laughs> what was that? Was that a lemur? Like a lima bunny thing and whoever's in there might have a medley of delicious cured meats <laughs> cured oh. cured meats uh. i don't think that's gonna work hello anyone home hi 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 this is eerie Capturing the Avatar is too important to leave in a teenager's oh. hands. He's mine now. Oh, shit. <gasps> oh. Keep them here. More tea, please. <laughs> oh, my God. 
What is it? Who is this even going to be? <gasps> Whoa. There are so many. Past lives? Katara, you really believe in that stuff? But who? I don't know. Dies, he's reincarnated into the next nation in the cycle. <gasps> out of it. Huh? Who is that? That's Avatar Roku, the Avatar before me. You were a firebender? Wow. That what? firebender won't know what hit him. Huh? That looks like a bat. <gasps> it's a Dinner. Don't listen to him. You're gonna be my new pet. <gasps> ah! <gasps> but what about the person? You're just a banished prince. No home, no allies. Your own father doesn't even want you. You're wrong. Wow. Once I deliver the avatar to my father, he will welcome me home with honor and restore. Ooh, Zuko's got daddy issues. I'm calling it. Prince Zuko, have you forgotten what happened last time you dueled the master? Oh, God. I will never forget. I mean, I'm glad that, like, these three are having fun. Come on out, little lemur. That hungry guy won't bother you any- Where is- <gasps> Firebenders? They were here? Oh, no. Oh! <gasps> So. Oh no. Hey, Aang, you find my dinner yet? Come on, Aang. Everything will be all right. Let's get out of here. <gasps> oh my god. The way she's just like walking around. Oh, 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 oh. Send word to the Fire Lord immediately. The Avatar has returned. Whoa. Like, he's just. Oh my. Oh my god. My God! What happened? He found out firebenders killed Giazzo. Oh no! It's his avatar spirit. He must have triggered it. I'm gonna try and. Yeah, and I guess it sends a signal over the whole world. <laughs> I think he's gonna win. Do it! Ooh! That's it? Your father raised a coward. Next time you get in my way, I promise. I won't hold back. Oof. And that's on that. Did you really mean that, Uncle? Of course. I told you Jing Sang Tea is my favorite. Aww. <laughs> oh, God. Aang is... <sighs> know how hard it is to lose the people you love. I went through the same thing when I lost my mom. Oh! And the other airbenders may be gone. But you still have a family. Sokka and I, we're your family now. He's like, um, he's just like a ball of grief. Katara and I aren't gonna let anything happen to you. Promise. Hmm. I'm sorry. It's okay. It wasn't your fault. But you were right. And if firebenders found this temple, that means they found the other ones too. Oh. I really am the last airbender. 
Oh, oh yeah. Oh yeah, the name of the show. Together. Katara, Sokka, say hello to the newest member of our family. What are you going to name him? Momo. Momo. Oh, <laughs> Momo's little like sad purrs. I think that's what they are. Oh, that was like that was genuinely very touching. I think because you're literally watching a child go through grief which is like that's really hard to watch like as just found out not only does he have the entire weight of the world on his shoulders but like all of his people are gone um and he's kind of got this mission i guess to stop this war but he's also just like figuring things out for himself um yeah it's it's really sad actually but I think because of that, I don't know, It it's just, it's sad because he's like, he's gone and he's like found that his people have just been like killed and he's just somehow got to deal with that and that's, that's hard. However, I don't think we are done just yet with figuring out why he had to go to the sanctuary sanctuary the sanctum whatever it was called i think he now has a personal link to roku was that his name i feel like because his like eyes did the shiny thing and all of their eyes lit up and i now feel like somehow ang is connected to him and i wonder if he'll become like a like what Navi is in Zelda, right? She just comes out when you need help. Like i wonder if it's going to be like that. So although immediately he can't see what that has helped him with. But I think in time, we will see that become more of a thing, if that makes sense. So everyone, thank you so much for watching my reaction and I will see you in my next video. Goodbye.